Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today, we're addressing a tricky issue that many developers encounter when working with JBoss EAP7. Our viewer has run into a no-class-def found error after excluding the web services subsystem and adding CXF Maven dependencies. Let's dive into the details of this problem and explore potential solutions together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. In JBoss EAP7, when you exclude the web services subsystem and add CXF dependencies, you might encounter a no class def found error. This error indicates that a required class could not be found during the server startup. The first step to troubleshoot this issue is to ensure that all necessary dependencies are included in your pom.xml file. Make sure you have the correct CXF dependencies listed. Next, let's look at the JBoss deployment structure.xml file. You need to ensure that you are excluding the correct subsystems and including the necessary modules. After updating the JBoss deployment structure.xml, if you still encounter errors, check if the Spring module is correctly installed in JBoss. This is crucial for resolving dependencies related to Spring. Finally, if the issue persists, review the error logs for any additional missing classes or dependencies. This will help you identify what else might be required for your application to start successfully. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're encountering a no-class-def found error in JBoss EAP7 after excluding the web services subsystem, here's a solution. You need to add a specific dependency to your project. The issue arises because javax.xml.ws.endpoint is included in a JBoss module, but when you remove the web services dependency, the web app class loader can't access it. This can lead to conflicts during deployment. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the no-class-def-found error in JBoss EAP7, you need to configure the JBoss deployment structure.xml file correctly. Make sure to exclude the logging subsystem and specify the necessary module exclusions. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the no-class-def-found error in JBoss EAP7, ensure that you have installed the Spring Custom module and included the necessary dependency in the JBoss deployment structure.xml file. Check that your JBoss deployment structure.xml includes the correct module dependency for org.apache.cxf.impl. For more detailed guidance, refer to the Stack Overflow link provided.
And that's it guys. We've gone through the solutions and I'm hoping that it resolved your issue. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.